Man, we're dealing with some shit cunts today. First, I gotta go to work. So I'll see you a little later. I don't have a handlebar mount for the camera, so I probably shouldn't be doing this, but here we go. slow you down more than anything. I make this commute in the same time that I drive a lot of the time or sometimes I'll even go even faster if I leave a little late and I hit the rush hour traffic it's faster on a bike. Sun in the sky, sun in the sky, you know how I feel. Birds flying high. two miles from work this is where I leave you I, I spend a hundred bu fifty bucks a week on food and I eat whatever the fuck I want just you know I just went into Walmart and there's 
hardly anything. Okay, so first meal, Daterade. Got another jug in there that's full. So two liters of Daterade, about 1,200 calories. So I just left work and I'm back on that bridge again. Where, and I guess this is where a lot of the cyclists go, commuting on the day, daily. And this lady's down at the corner before you turn onto the bridge, just ringing a bell and she goes, good job. And I'm just like so thankful for that. Cause right now uh, I'm dealing with like a knee issue. It's not painful, but it's, it's annoying. Cause I know it's, it's going probably not in the right direction you know chances are <laughs> in the next 20 years it's gonna become painful and uh, it's fucking getting me down man because this is like this is life man <laughs> this is life like I don't need to explain it having an knee issue sucks if you want to be an active person and uh, just a good reminder to be a cheerleader in life and like that lady she is like the coolest chick ever just cheering people on saying good job you know just be being encouraging so yeah be a cheerleader man that lady was one thing i mean you know she she made me feel good she reminded me there's an intellectual kind of part of uh emotional health like you know there there's uh Here's what you gotta do. Here's how you gotta think, and that's really important. And then there's just the raw power side of it, where you just gotta fucking execute, you know? And that's like 99% of it. Like, there's all kinds of techniques and, you know, anecdotes, like stories and stuff that people can share. And, oh, you know, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna be more like that. Uh, you know, do this. You know what I'm talking about. Like, there's a, those. There are all kinds of great techniques and uh, just things you can do in your life, like getting on a bike, eating more simple sugars, drink more water, blah blah blah. But uh, uh, and, and you know, just how to, how to treat people, and nonviolent communication, and stuff like that. But the real most important part that you fucking get outside, you move your body, you know, and you just follow the basic health fundamentals, sleep, water, sugar, and, and exercise, sunshine, the life of purpose. That's it, man. The, the real important part isn't that you're learning, you know, you can sit in school and be studying the most, you can be studying philosophy, you know, or just the deepest, most relevant stuff. It all means nothing if you're not out there fucking enjoying the sunshine, enjoying life, like, so yeah, I've, I've put on 20, uh, 20 something miles, 23 miles or whatever, yeah, about 23 miles probably, I'm just about home, and uh, that lady, you know, she made my day, like, there's no denying that, uh, being the cheerleader and stuff, but really, what what really made my day was getting out, moving my body, man. Like, I was literally, like, suffering from a... I think I might just do a few more miles on the bike just, just to, like, clear my head, like, get out the bullshit, man. Like, sweat out the toxins and just, you know, pump, pump, pump the body a little more. Get, keep the blood going to my brain and all that. Because it's just it's fixing my emotional problems right now. Like, I, I, was, I was super duper duper fucking depressed just about my knee, man. Uh, you know, it's freaking me out. And I'm like, okay, yeah, I gotta get it checked out. But right now, it's not causing me any problems. Like, I, I could do 100 miles today. You know, I could. I, I've been lifting heavy shit all day. And, so. It was just a mental thing. And uh, got it out of my system. Uh, until I have a doctor tell me, hey, look, 
You, you can't fucking ride a bike. I have no reason to not be doing it. And I wish I had just realized that. Like, even my knee feels better riding on the bike. I'm not kidding. And I know, I've had this happen to me before, and I'm like, oh yeah. Well, that's just your mind, that's just psychological. Well, so what? You know, what if it is just psychological? Like, it, I feel better. So do what makes you feel good, man, because you could die tomorrow. There, it's always the right time to do the right thing. Here's the last meal of the day. That's uh, $5 worth of organic sweet potatoes. About 1,200 calories or something. I don't know. And uh, broccoli, maybe a pound, pound and a half, so that's like... Um, you know, 250 worth of broccoli. Put some flax seeds on there, some spices.